Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to Karen Rolton Oval. You join us for this match between Netherlands and Nepal. I'm Mike Atherton, and with me in the commentary box today is Mel Jones, Ali Mitchell, Ian Healy, and the one and only Lord Gower. Hi, Mike. Thanks for that intro. Earlier, I took a look at the conditions for the day. And it's been an enthralling contest between these two teams. Yep. Nicely played. Perfect timing. You can't fault that shot. Nicely played, and it was four runs all the way. A little short on that occasion. Needs to adjust the length slightly to be just a little fuller. Too short on this pitch. Yep. And as we've seen already, it makes it very easy to score. A couple on offer here. Yep. Good yes. cap. Yes. Out. A trudge back to the pavilion, a disappointing display in the end. For someone with such batting skills, this goes down as a fail. It's a long way to walk out here just to walk straight back. They'll just want to get this first one behind them and then push on. Wait! Can't get that outside the ring field. Really good shot there. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot, and there was absolutely no point in chasing that. Yep, yep. That's right out of the middle of the bat. There was a bit of width on that, and they've climbed into the shot to send it up and over for six. Questions will begin to be asked. Should the captain make a change? A big over that one, too many loose deliveries. The right arm pace bowler is coming into the attack from the press box end. The whole team goes up for that one. They feel pretty confident about this. They've got to go without scoring. This is a real purple patch for the bowler. They've got one of the main batters out, LBW. Coming to the wicket, they'll be looking to play within the V early and expand as they get settled. Yep. Edged. Brilliant bowling. Having got the edge the previous ball, they now know the areas they need to be hitting. Waiting. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Perfect technique and placement. That really wasn't a great delivery. Seen early and it was dispatched with aplomb. I'd like to see them aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. We're on! Short and wide, did well to get some bat on that. Well placed, should get a single. 
end of the over. Nepal are two for 25. Of any chance. Wait there. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Just through the shot, too early. Wow! How did that miss? That was just a coat of paint away from hitting the wickets. Great bowling, deserved better. Obviously didn't like the look of that one and just ignored it. This is everything. A little late on that, no run scored. Waiting. Finds the fielder with that shot. Singh shakes their head. It was there to be hit, but couldn't make the most of it. Too good. Not sure anyone is going to cut that off. You could see by how it whistled away to the boundary just how sweetly this was timed. Yep. Good shot. A beauty. All the signs that they're reading the ball well guided it away off the back foot to the boundary rope. Nine runs added in that over. Netherlands are none for nine. A new bowler is coming into the attack. Yep. What a shot. First ball smashed it. Saw it from the moment it left the hand, latched onto it and given the full treatment. It can be very disheartening seeing good deliveries smacked around. Sometimes you've just got to accept it and move on. Yes. Great timing, right off the meat of the bat. That's what you pay the entrance money for. It's flown into the crowd. A brilliant shot off the front foot. No need to move. A boundary off the last ball. Is it a sign they're trying to push the run rate? edge. Nearly got through them. Just got onto it in time with enough bat speed to pick up four. Scores now level. Just one run needed. Only a batting meltdown could stop victory now. Yeah, yep. And that marks the end of the match. The Netherlands have taken the victory. Thank you. That win never looked in doubt.